Hi YouTube friends. Um, I am filming my very first video ever on my channel. Um, my channel is called Surrounded by Colors. Uh, it is a coloring channel uh, that is one of my major hobbies, coloring and reading, but this channel is going to be my coloring channel and hopefully I'll be posting more videos as time goes on. But I'm posting my very first video because I got happy mail or friend mail and I received this friend mail from the beautiful Tabitha from Tabby's Books and Blogs on YouTube. She is the sweetest woman. I've been watching her videos for quite a while now and she's just super sweet. I love her channel. I love watching her hauls. I love watching her coloring. Um, and it's she's just super sweet and she was very kind and sent me out this package um, funny because she had done a, a video for her 400 subscribers which by the way that's freaking awesome tabs way to go and she'd done a video giving away a couple coloring books and when she announced the winner my dumb butt was so excited I thought I had won I read the name and I'm like oh that's me and I had typed in oh I like sent her an email saying oh that's me I won and then I was like you know what maybe that wasn't my channel name <laughs> Because since I have no videos, I don't, you know, use this channel name often. And it was something about love of coloring, maybe, or something. Um, and I guess I just saw the word color, and I was like, ooh, I won. And so I went back and looked at her video and realized that uh, I definitely did not win. And I, I felt so silly. And so I emailed her back and be like, oops, sorry, that wasn't me. You know, and I congratulated the winner because, you know... I, I definitely was happy for them. I mean, I just had thought I'd won. Like, I, I jumped the gun, I guess. But I, Tabs was so kind and sent me friend mail anyway. So that's just awesome. She is awesome. So let's let's crack into this. Let's check it out. I did cut it open because I didn't want to do it on camera um, because I was doing it with a knife and it might be scary. Um, so I am going to reach in I haven't peeked okay so I did cut it open but I have not peeked um, and these are all coming from Tab's collection which is super sweet and generous of her and awesome I love I love coloring I'll color pretty much anything I have a large collection of coloring books also so let's see what have we got oops I don't know what that was for hold on one second let me um, I think that must have come with this book on accident. So, ooh, what have we got here? So, Crayola Day of the Dead, Dia de los Muertos, coloring book by Crayola. Crayola makes some really, I love Crayola products. I'm sorry, that's not in frame. Sorry, my bad, guys. Uh, this is my very first video. It's going to be kind of shoddy, and I don't know how to edit, so I apologize. Um, but I love Crayola. I love Crayola pencils. I love Crayola crayons and their coloring books are pretty good I've got a mandala coloring book from Crayola that I absolutely love and This is really awesome. It's gonna be the spooky season uh, Coming right around the corner, and I'm excited about that. I love Halloween I'm not so much into like super gore like movies, but I will color a good gory coloring book and I definitely love the cute spooky stuff and this is this is just super super awesome so um even though this isn't halloween it's day day of the dead but that's that's i don't know if it's similar i don't oh my gosh that shows how much i don't know like i i don't know much about this actual festival shame on me um but you know it's still super super duper awesome and maybe i should do some research so yeah very cute i will definitely do some coloring in here for sure Oh, yeah, look it. So, very nice. I don't know if you guys want flips of these books uh, and anyone actually comments on these videos, which I'll kind of be shocked, but if somebody actually watches this, aside from maybe tabs, and wants me to do a flip, a full flip of this, I, I will. Um, like I said, I do want to create more videos. I just, I have four boys at home, four little, you know, younger boys and a couple older boys. Two are older, two are younger. My life is full and busy, but 
you know, coloring is a passion and I would love, I mean, I've been following ColorTube for quite a long time and I would just love to become a more of a part of it and a creator of content. Look at this, it's very lovely. Oh, and it, this has some color by number stuff as well. Um, and a few activities. I have a um, nine-year-old son who's on the autism spectrum that loves doing like puzzles and things. So he would, he would love to help me with some of those. So oh, that, that's really cute. Oh, this has like their altars. Mm, that's kind of sad because it looks like a little kid's altar. That's kind of depressing, but anyway, very cute. Thank you so much, Tabs. I, I'll enjoy that book. All right, next. Let's see here. Oh my goodness. Oh, I just realized these are notes from tabs. Oh my, I am such a ding dong. I am such a ding dong. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I was like, what is that note for? <laughs> uh, I never get mail, okay? So I just assumed it. I don't even know. Uh, obviously it's for me. Um, and, and tabs, don't worry. Like, you know, it doesn't matter how long it takes. Bless your heart for even sending it. Oh my God. Yes. I felt so bad about the misunderstanding. Oh my gosh. Bless you. Bless you. Um, and I actually sent you some friend mail as well, tabs. I, I sent you a book, um, that, uh, it's a Fabio Atanasio book. She just came out with it. It's Mythagoria. Um, and I forget what the actual title is, but it's a, it's a horror book and I just, I couldn't resist. I bought one for myself and for you. Oops. I'm so sorry about that guys. Um, so that we could do some buddy colors, but you should be getting that soon. I, I don't know exactly what day. I think I, I messaged you the day or whatever, but anyway, Tabs, you are a beautiful person. Thank you so much. I really do appreciate this. You are just so sweet. And let's see. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is zombies. Holy poop. Zombie coloring book. Oh, okay. So my one, one of my middle boys is obsessed with like zombies and, um, and he loves colorings too. So he will have a blast helping me color in this. And wow, that's, that's pretty, that's pretty cool. All right, let's see what we got. I'll just give you a quick flip. Oh my goodness. I'm so sorry if these are not in frame, guys. Wow. Huh, huh, they're grilling up fingers. Like hot dogs. Oh my gosh, I love this. I think my phone is like slowly falling. Hold on, I'm filming on my phone, y'all, and it is just um, pretty, pretty ghetto set up here. There we go. Oh, and my head is blocking my lamp. I don't know why all of a sudden it went like dark. Mm. Mm. Not top notch quality, guys. I'm so sorry. Um, but it looks like these zombies are like legit just doing everyday things, and that is so cool. It's like zombies just having fun every day, everyday stuff. You've got these kids like playing in the water with water balloons, and they're all like eyeball falling out, worm coming out of the dude's face. Heck yeah. Oh my god, they're playing leapfrog. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Oh, look. That's my kids just playing playing Xbox all day long. Um, thank god my kids aren't zombies though. But, you know. Sometimes I think they'll turn into zombies the way they sit there and play their games. But, uh, that's fun. Fun. Oh, she's lifting weights. Yeah, work it out, girl. Work it out, girl. And he's skateboarding. Love it. Oh yeah, look at these queens. They're, she's just eating her brains and she's looking at TikTok. Aww. Just having a nice little moment there. I think she needs to do a little something something with that. Oh yeah, ride that bike. Yeah, these are cool. Oh, I'm looking at Zinder. <laughs> Alright, this is awesome. I do I do like this. I'm gonna get a big kick out of coloring this. And I don't have anything like this at all. I'm sorry, I feel like I'm blabbing a lot. This is cute. Oh my goodness. They're just innocently playing with squirt guns. And, you know, they're all falling apart and stuff. All her, like, teeth are showing through her cheek. 
All right, that's good stuff right there. That's that's fun. All right, this is gonna be real spooky to color. Oh, they're bowling with a head. Playing some basketball. Oh, how sweet. Um, <laughs> that's a little <laughs> messed up. Oh, but that's good. Good stuff. I'm gonna have fun coloring this book. And oh, we're a little zombie kitty kitty. I love little kitties. But, all right, awesome, Tabs, thank you. That's a cool book, and like I said, I have nothing, absolutely nothing that is, is like that at all here. Um, so, let's check out, ooh, oh, a Creative Haven, George Tufexis. See, you couldn't possibly know this about me, but I love George Tufexis. Now, when I first started coloring, I did not like color by numbers. I was like, why would you want somebody else to choose the colors that you're putting on the page? I couldn't understand why somebody would like that. And I'm like, that's, that's so childish. Only little kids do color by numbers. And then I got a George Tufexis book. And I was like, whoa, this is le legit, like difficult. And when I finished the page, I couldn't believe how gorgeous it looked, um, how just vibrant it was and I was hooked so I think I, I got his Christmas one of the Christmas books um, and I literally colored all like winter I colored that book one year um, and so I, I love it I, I have a couple of his books I do not have by the sea I've passed this book up so many times because I'm like oh I really need to finish some more before I buy more of his books so this is awesome love George Tufexis I love Creative Haven books anyway they, they've got good good quality they're good quality they're relatively inexpensive um for the quality you get for sure oh man this will be really fun to color next summer yes yes i'm so sorry guys uh, i'm not used to having to do that but yeah look at how beautiful these pictures are look at that like beachside fishing with the doggo I have three dogs, guys. Unfortunately, I don't have any cats. I love cats, but I've got three dogs and four children and a husband, and my house is crazy. But look at this, and this one's colored, which is so pretty. Tabs, did you do this? Did you color this? This is gorgeous. I don't know who colored that. If you did tabs, it is amazing. But I love that, and I love <laughs> how the alcohol marker shows through and makes like an image on the backside. I always got that. I love it. So that is really cool. This is really cool. Thank you. And I, and I honestly, I love getting coloring books that have been in someone else's collection that they may be de-stashed um, be, because I love getting some of their work. Like, I, I think it's really cool. I think it's really cool to get somebody else's art. Um, it's like art within art and I love it. But really nice. Thank you so much, Tabs. Look at those buildings. Love, like I said, love George Fexus. Oh, oh my gosh, there's my terror incarnate. That's my fear. I really, I'm so scared of Ferris wheels, guys. I don't know why, but I am. And that is just, oh, I can picture the terror right now just thinking about it. I don't mind roller coasters, but put me on a Ferris wheel and I will be crying. Oh, look at this one with the driftwood. So, okay, I live right by Lake Erie. I live in Ohio, right by Lake Erie. Um, literally, like, my house, I can see the lake from my front yard. And I just, I love looking out at the lake. It's not the ocean, believe me, but it is gorgeous. And uh, the, some of the driftwood and things that show up on the, on the shore are just really pretty. And there's nothing like walking on the beach and finding cool little driftwood bits that look unique and and we find this glass that we call beach glass and it's like glass that has been pounded by the waves and like rounded and it's so pretty too so i just i love water i love yeah i love love it so thank you so much that is lovely lovely george to fix this tabs you are just too sweet this is like a whole bunch oh my god i think there's two more in here holy poop you did not have to do this. Oh my god, and another George Tufexis. And I don't have this one either. Autumn Inspirations. And that's banger because Autumn is right around the corner. So, heck yeah. Tabs, you rock. Like, seriously, thank you. Oh my god, look how cute that is. A little scarecrow guy. 
And I love how the books have um, these pictures right here so you can reference. It's super awesome. Um, what is kind of annoying though is they don't have like the color swatches down here. So you have to kind of flip and go back over there. But I've definitely cut one out before so I can just use my little cutout strip as long as it's the same. I don't know that they're all the same though. But anyway, I'm sorry. I'm like just blabbering and not showing you guys the coloring book. That's really cool. I can just imagine all the fall colors, some farm scenes, hiking. Now, when it gets to be fall around here and the trees are just gorgeous, I love it. I love fall time. That is my favorite time. Oh, look at that little kitty, kitty, kitty. But nothing, however, beat the fall time in North Carolina, in the mountains. Um, I lived in North Carolina for quite a while um, by Charlotte. And every fall we would go up into the mountains to go hiking. And it was just, that is the most beautiful place I've ever seen in the fall. So. Oh, look at that picture. I'm, I'm doing this one. I am doing this one this fall. That is, that's awesome. All right, I'm definitely going to be on this book this fall for sure. For Shizzle. I'm sorry. Oh my gosh. I, that is so lame. I'm so lame, guys. <laughs> I'm around like preteens and teens too much. So anyway, this is really cool though. I am really... Uh, tabs, you went out of your way that it... All right, awesome. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I cannot thank you enough. All right, let's see. Drum roll, please. Last book, and it is Halloween. Oh my gosh, I love it. Color by number for adults from, ooh, Prachi Dewan Sachdeva. Okay, I another illustrator that I absolutely love. I love Prachi, I love Sachin, um, I have I have several Sachin books. I think this is my only Prachi book, though, but I love them. I, I want some. I just, I, like I said, I had a color by number thing when I first started truly getting back into coloring in 2020, and I was all like, you know, no color by numbers. And then, honestly, I think after I'd gotten my Creative Haven color by number, George Tufexis, I had looked into getting some of Sachin's color by number books, and I fell in love with those. And so, yeah, this is like my second favorite color by number artists, um, Prachi and Sach, Sach, uh, Sach and Sach Deva. Anyway, I don't have this book for sure. Super cute. And this will be, I think, easy enough. It says for adults, but I think this one, usually her books are a little easy on the easier side, which compared to, you know, so this compared to like, you know something like that these ones i can have like some, my my younger son do so oh and there's one that's done that is so pretty look at that you know this is what i love about sachin the Sach davis their colors pop okay some color by number books they choose these kooky colors and you're like what in the world like why is there a you know like orange grape on the table or whatever they would have just some weird colors that was a horrible example, but this looks great. I love it. So colorful. Another day of the dead. Oh, look how cute. Oh yeah, I'm gonna have so much fun with this. And these are like easy colors. Alcohol markers. I have a crud load of alcohol markers that are that I've just amassed over the past couple years. Um, so I can just go to town. Look at how cute that is. I love that. Oh yeah, tabs, this is awesome. Oh my God, look at the kitties. I love that. This is so cute. Okay, I I actually can't wait to color out of this. And I have so many fall coloring books to choose from, but this is definitely going to get colored in because I mean just look at that. Like look look how adorable that writing is. I love it. That's cute. And these are, like I said, they're just such easy, quick colors. Like, if you just want to get some color on paper. Oh, look. That's cute. So, 
anyway awesome awesome i'm just i'm just thrilled so tabs you went above and beyond you are amazing you're just you're such a kind person and i really love watching your channel i love hearing your adventures and seeing your little hauls and big hauls and all of your supplies and it's it's really fun honestly you you are just one of the kind kind souls and thank you so much i really appreciate this so we've got halloween cumber color by number for adults by prachi dewan Suchdeva. We've got Autumn Inspirations by George Dufexis. We've got By the Sea by George Dufexis, uh, Creative Haven. We've got the Zombie Coloring Book, which I did not see an illustrator listed. Um, this is probably one of one of those books um, on Amazon that I mean I don't think it's stolen images they all look like they're pretty similar so it looks like they're by one illustrator um but possibly they're like um what like where you like buy them from a a place that the the artist i forget what that what it's called but not not photoshop but you know whatever you guys know what i'm talking about and they like purchase the rights to to the pictures or whatever so um but i don't know why you wouldn't put an illustrator down on here but yeah i don't i don't see one um not on the back few pages not on the back cover <coughs> there's the isbn number though back there if you're interested in it and i don't see anything on the front cover yeah it just says zombie coloring book hmm. oh well that's okay and then the last book, last but not least, we have the color, uh, Crayola Coloring Book, Day of the Dead. And let me see if there is a... Oh, bonus stickers inside. I didn't even look for the stickers. Um, let me see if there is a, an illustrator. Oh my god, there is stickers! Look at that! I love stickers, guys. Love stickers. Those are so cool. Um, Buzz Pop. So this is a Buzz Pop coloring book, and it doesn't say a specific author, I don't think. Um, oh, cool! And it actually tells you about the day of the dead. That's really neat. I'm gonna have to read that because, like I said, I I don't know anything. Oh, so it is like right after Halloween. Okay, cool. Um, oh, chance. I'm making a video, honey. My dogs like to bark a lot. But anyway, um, yeah, so Buzz Pop Coloring Book, very nice. Tabs, thank you so much. Uh, I really, 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 really appreciate it as my phone is like going wonky again. You are the sweetest, and just thank you so much. And I really hope to, to have some more videos uh, to post and possibly, you know, grow a YouTube channel. I, dogs. I have my hands full at home though, but I really do want to post some more videos. I just got some uh, some more um, Halloween autumn themed coloring materials coming, and so maybe I'll do some flip throughs um, and some unboxings of that. Um, so yeah, and I have a I can always color. I love like I color all the time. Any free time I get, I'm coloring or reading. So. All right, y'all, thank you so much for spending a few minutes with me. It was really nice to get a video filmed. Sorry about my finger there. Um, I appreciate I appreciate anyone that watches this, and thank you guys so much. I hope you all have a great day, a great week, and, you know, be safe and, you know, have fun with whatever you're doing. Thank you, guys. Bye.